Lily Grace Kershaw. So you're 12 years old and you're on the brink of becoming the youngest female Eagle Scout in Mississippi history. When I say that, what does that make you think? I don't know. I'm really proud of myself and I think my grandfather would have been too. Yeah, let's talk about your grandfather for a moment. You did a really nice tribute to your hometown and your grandfather. Talk about what you did and why you did it. So I painted a mural because I love art and I became an Eagle Scout because my grandfather was an Eagle Scout and I wanted to make him proud. Yeah, and that, that's a big thing for you and, and we're, we got it right here actually below us. Your murals for Clint. Talk about your grandfather's influence on you into this. Um, I'm trying to think. Well, when I was, when I first became a Scout, he was helping me um, like learn the things that I need to learn and he actually helped me earn some of these merit badges, but yeah, I think he was a really big influence on me. Yeah, because, and, yeah. yeah, and, and that's and that's wonderful. Talk about what it takes to earn certain ones of these badges. I mean, look, they all look a little bit different. I'm sure they yeah. all. Look, but talk about just maybe a couple of them and what you do to become or and, and earn these things. Some of them are really hard, and some of them are relatively easy. But I'd say one of the harder ones is probably cycling. It's this one. Um, I had to cycle 50 miles in one day. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, you, like like on a bike, mm -hmm. 50 miles. Mm -hmm. She's more athletic than me too. So you're smarter, more dedicated, and more athletic. Uh, there you go. You you deserve what you got. <laughs> uh, becoming the youngest Eagle Scout. For people that don't know, maybe what the Scouts are. Can you mm -hmm. tell them what that is? Um. Yeah, I think it's a really great program because it teaches you good leadership skills and also good life skills. And what are some of the things you've learned, like, life skills-wise? Um, well, a lot of cooking <laughs> <laughs> for the cooking merit badge. And then, I well, actually, this one, this is the communications merit badge. Mm -hmm. That was really helpful for me to learn, like, public speaking. Well, I guess that's kind of what you're doing right now, right? Yeah. And, and it was amazing. You're, you're not even nervous to do something like this, and I find that just fascinating, or just a little bit. <laughs> just a little bit. Just a little bit. All right, so what's the next step? So you got about two months before you mm -hmm. become an Eagle Scout or months, uh, go yeah. before the board. What's next after you become an Eagle Scout? Um, one of my sort of just a fun goal is to earn all of the merit badges, and there's 138. 138. And right now I have... 37. Wow, that, I mean, that's amazing. And then one more time, talk about you, you, you painted this mural and, and, uh, for Clint, because mm -hmm. that's where you live. Yeah. And how much work did it go into painting this whole thing? I worked about 61 hours on the entire project. You know exactly the amount of hours you worked. I do, <laughs> because I typed it in there like yesterday. So how many days was that? Over 61 over how many days? Oh, goodness. I'm not exactly sure, but I did the painting over two days. Is there any projects you're working on like this coming up? Mm. Or brainstorming? I don't believe so. No, just doing the Eagle Scout things, the, the big one. Yeah.